Hey guys, we have a little unboxing uh, review video for a Dremel uh, 300 series. It's a kit. Um, you know, it's a variable speed rotary tool. It's got three attachments and 21 accessories. This tool was on sale down at the uh, Home Depot for uh, $50 on uh, clearance. The regular, like, $81, $100, somewhere around there. And the kit uh, contains the, uh, the tool itself, as well as a little uh, detailer's grip and a flexi shaft for getting into, uh, you know, tighter areas, as well as a sanding guide, as well as the, uh, you know, wrench and uh, various tips and sanding uh, stones and stuff. It has a uh, four-year warranty, so we'll uh, we'll tear into it and uh, see how it goes. So once you got the paper covering off and the little uh, zip tie cut, you got a little box that kind of looks like a tackle box. You open her up, you find a little tray, kind of what you'd find in the uh, toolbox. You pull out the tray, you find a little cardboard plug. This houses pretty much everything. And, uh, you pull out. This has your uh, sanding pads, your cutting discs, as well as your wrench and your buffing pads you know, assorted uh, accessories. You flip up the uh, little flap. You find your little uh, detailer's tool as well as uh, the flexi shaft. The uh, flexi shaft on here is 36 inches, 24 to 36 inches long, and uh, after you've got that out, you find the Dremel itself. And of course, you got all your wonderful instructions and uh, warranty uh, papers and everything. But you have your Dremel here. Plugs into, of course, your simple 110. Have your on off switch, as well as your uh, control here. It kind of variables the speed. And a uh, little blue button you press down, it locks the uh, shaft here so you can change the bit, kind of similar to your angle grinder or, uh, you know, other tools. You uh, untwist this here. This comes off. And then uh, you untwist the little uh, chuck here. And you twist on the little flexi shaft. This uh, you twist on the uh, little flexi shaft, just like that, and then you can lay the Dremel down on your workbench beside you, and you can do the flexi shaft here for your uh, finer detail work. It has the on-off switch here. Put your little uh, keeper on the end of here and you can run your bits and stuff right off of here. Kind of saves uh, fatigue on your hands while you're doing the finer work. 
And one thing nice about the whole Dremel series is it is expandable. You can buy other bits and accessories for it. And I figured for $50 you can't really go wrong. Especially for getting, you know, cleaning out. You, you can do, uh, you know, small drilling, small, uh, you know, light sanding. You know, you won't want to be, uh, you know, sanding down a car or nothing with it, of course. But it's for the finer uh, woodworking. You can buy uh, accessory kits, like 100-piece accessory kits for the rotary tools and stuff like that. You see them on sale. But uh, I'll do a review of this later on down the road. But um, as... You know, in uh, for the purpose of the unboxing part of the video in terms of packaging and uh, first off appearance, it's very professional. The packaging was good. Getting it out of the box wasn't a pain. You know, you didn't end up... Uh, wasn't like unpackaging a barbecue or something like that was next to impossible. Um, on this, I'd probably give it about a 9 out of 10. Probably the zip tie was probably the hardest thing to cut to, to uh, do with the packaging. Uh, this has been an unboxing and uh, review of a Dremel 300 series. As always, thank you for watching Maxwell's World. Comment, subscribe, enjoy.